What's up, fam? Welcome back to our Z Roll, and today we're really excited because we're still talking about Disney World. Mm -hmm. We're talking about what we brought back from Disney World. All right, guys, so we got a, just a good souvenir haul from Disney World. We went into this trip wanting some like specific things like we knew we were kind of looking for. So we didn't go like ham on souvenirs, but ham. we got... Is that... No, that's, that's the word I use. So I've never heard you use the word ham before. I've got it from you. We didn't go ham on souvenirs. Right. But I like that. I think we got some good stuff. So I'm excited to show you guys. So here we go. I feel like it's always appropriate to start out with the coffee. So Will we ever have a vlog without coffee? That was actually um, a, a question. common question that we've gotten actually several times. And the answer is probably not. Probably not. Even in our halls. Yeah, even in our halls. Yeah. Like it's just, it's just such a part of us. Mm -hmm. We got Mickey's coffee, little hipster Mickey mm -hmm. on there, it's hanging out. Uh, I love the graphics, you have like um, Minnie Mouse uh, right here on the side of it as well. And it's like a, like a, like a text thread, um, it says good morning, um, me before coffee in a picture and then me after coffee with a picture. Brew can do it. It was actually pretty good. Mm -hmm. um, it's called Mickey's Morning, it's a dark roast. Yeah. I feel like it was, we liked it, it was good. It's got more of like a little bit of a more, like a bittery kind of taste to it than I like, the more we drank it. So I don't know if I would buy it again. We're kind of more like a French roast kind of person, so anything that's other than French roast, like we'll drink for yeah. sure, but um, I don't know if we would buy this particular one again. Right. But we did like it. We did. And it's nice that it's already pre-ground and everything, so you can actually drink it in your like, your resort or things like that. But yeah, mm -hmm. it right. does have like a little, uh, I don't even know how to explain that, but it has mm -hmm. like a uh, like a dessert coffee kind of feel, which is interesting because it's for the morning. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and so yeah. it's kind of interested by that. I wasn't expecting that it would be more of a dessert coffee, mm -hmm. but that was good. So on the lines of coffee, well- I feel like that just turned into a review, <laughs> like a coffee review. Not what's supposed One's to be. not intended. <laughs> but we'll go into our mug. So we always try to like at least like not get more than two, but we got three, but one good. of them is not like a coffee yeah. mug, right? And so this is my um, tumbler, is that what you call them? Um, but it has the lid on there, it's got buzz, it's like Pixar theme, so we've got um, Nemo and Dory, and you've got Lightning McQueen on there, but this is awesome because we use this at the resort, and if you buy these at the resort, you get free refills, so we got free, well, free refills of coffee, and you can get soda, tea, whatever you want. We mainly use it for coffee. Mainly for coffee. I think I did mm. get one soda. You got some sodas, yeah. but. Yeah, but it's cool, because right now, like, 2021, with COVID, they're not refilling them, so they just give you, like, a Coke, or they give you um, a like coffee. An, an extra a cup extra of Extra cup, it. yeah, and they don't but put it's always it in like, there. It's always, the cup is really, is actually big. It's like bigger than what would fit in there, so. Yeah. Kind of, it's kind of cool, because then, like, if, for example, for coffee, like, you should probably saw it in the vlogs, but the coffee was cool, because mm -hmm. she likes hers with cream, I like my black, and so we were able to kind of, like, put half in here with her cream, yeah. and then half in the cup they provide. Right, because I won't drink, like, a whole, like cup yeah. either. Yeah, actually, yeah, it was probably more so, like that much coffee. Yeah, so it worked out well yeah, for us. Great. So, and I thought this was really cute. And I use these for work, so it's perfect. And then for the mugs, we got the Fort Wilderness mug. We have got this the first day, which never really happens for mugs. We usually yeah. kind of wait it out, but when I saw it, I'm like, I, I want it. That's this. The mug. It reminds us of where we stayed at. Yes. Um, and actually is really cool because the boys love this mug because they're I mean, they're still it. talking about the cabins. They want yeah. to go back so bad. And so they love this mug because they just, they just like, stare at it when we're drinking coffee. They're like, that's our cabin. You know? <laughs> um, but it says, uh, wake up, smell the campfire. And smell the campfire. And, yeah, and yeah. right here. So yeah, wake up and smell the campfire. Pretty cool little logo there. Um, the only thing about downside about this is that it's not... Uh, dishwasher safe. Dishwasher safe. Yeah. But... Whatever, doesn't matter. The mug is too cool not to buy. And we definitely wanted one from Fort Wilderness. That was kind of like our yeah. goal, because we have a lot of just like Disneyland, Disney World mugs, so we thought that would be really cool. And just a good like remembrance of the trip, yeah. so. But we did get one more, and this one wasn't just rush or save either, but <laughs> I love Aladdin. Um, it's like see-through, which is cool, because I love seeing like my color of my coffee. And it has the lamp on there, and then the back it says, wishing for the weekend. You can't really see it very well there. And then the handle, it's got like some sparkly like um, sequences. They're like little lamps. I love this because I love Aladdin and like teal is one of my favorite colors too, but 
This is like my favorite mug to drink out of right now. So I was so excited. It's a bummer that we like these mugs, but they're, again, they're not dishwasher safe, so we're constantly washing, washing. these. <laughs> I guess that's good. That's good. Next, I wanted to try to find a hat. I don't own very many hats. I've got like two compared to you, who I was like 2,000. But <laughs> 2, you have a lot hats. of hats. But I got this one. It's tie-dye. It's got Mickey on it. If you guys watched our vlogs, you saw me on wear it and then um it says walt disney world on the back as well i've actually worn this a lot since like yeah. we've been back you, mm -hmm. you noticed that i really like yeah, it yeah she's always worried when she buys like clothes in disney world she's like, am i gonna wear this outside of the park yeah. which i think is a great question right to ask and but she wasn't sure on this one and both cast and i are like yes you will yeah. you will wear this and i have and she has i really like it yeah. so this is my my hat and as far as hats go i'm kind of i'm kind of picky like i like trucker hats and kind of stuff with like like flat kind of bills and stuff. Like I don't like stuff that kind of folds in. I just, I don't think I look, I don't think I pull them off, I guess. Mm -hmm. I guess that's kind of like lame to say, but I, I, I don't know, I just don't like them. So, yeah. um, couldn't really find anything. Disney doesn't make a lot of flat bill hats, and so it's always a, it's always a hunt when I go to Disney World. Right? And I know that, that. I know yeah. that going in. I know it's a hunt, I'm not complaining, but it's always a hunt. <laughs> uh, Cassie found this actually um, in Epcot. Yeah. And I love it, because it says Walt Disney World Resort. It's super like 80s looking, it is. which I love. Um, flat bill, um, but the cool thing about it is all this, all the design on here has like um, spaceship Earth, aka the Epcot ball. Okay, we call it the Epcot. We ball. call it the Epcot ball, and I know people probably like. Well, they did. Cry. You did. And I know it's spaceship Earth. <laughs> we know. But we just we couldn't get that out of vocabulary. It was the Epcot ball. It's just a ball. It's so, Epcot. It's Epcot ball. But we know. It's Spaceship Earth. Thank you for letting us know that. <laughs> um, and uh, we, it's like when I call like the Disney Cruise a boat. I know. And everyone's like, it's a ship. I'm like, it sure, certainly is. It is definitely a ship. And I still call it a boat. It's just our vocabulary um, we're working on. <laughs> uh, anyway, and so it has um, the, castle. Like the castle and it has um, the Tower of Terror. Tower of Terror. And then so basically all the iconic um, places, tree of life, tree of life yeah. um, and all, all the lands kind of a thing. So mm -hmm. I really like this. I've worn it a ton since we've been back. Mm -hmm. um, people yeah, look have. at me kind of funny when I wear it because... The colors are so like 80s. Yeah, and, yeah. It, and it looks like it's like a, like a, it looks like it's like a beanie or something like that, like a skull cap kind of a thing. People thought it was a skull cap because of how it looks when I put it backwards. Oh, yeah. I'd be like, that's, that's a, you have a skull cap on? I'm like, no, it's a, it's a hat. So <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Now moving on to probably my favorite souvenir is my ears. Uh, I got these at Animal Kingdom. They're the giraffe print, but I was so excited to get these. The lamp's kind of like blocking, or it looks weird, but um, they're like sequiny, and I love that. And they, when we first went in that morning, I like saw them, I'm like, I want those. And so we went to that place to get them, and they were like, we are so sold out, you can check there was like a store in Africa, so we went back there and they had them. So I was so excited. Cassidy told me for my birthday, um, she'd buy me some ears. So these were my birthday present, but they're my favorite ears right now. Love them. Yeah. And what's crazy is we actually had a spot for all of her ears to be put on the wall before we left. And then we got home and I decided to rework <laughs> the studio. So she no longer has a spot to hang them. Which is kind of a bummer. I will soon. It's like so. the story of our life. Yeah. It gets me perfect the way we want it, and then it's like a day later, I'm like, ah, eh, let's change it. <laughs> <laughs> and this goes without saying, we we got a, we got some toys for the boys as yeah. well, and um, we're not gonna show those, but we got like a we got like a Buzz Lightyear, which you saw. We also got a Woody. That was actually a, a present from um, my mom. Yeah. Um, she wanted to buy the boys like each yeah. a little souvenir toy. Yep. And then Tucker picked out Ducky from Toy Story 4. They pretty much just got any toy from Toy Story. That was yeah, their thing. Yeah, it was their theme. And, he, and he got Toy Forky Story. as well. Forky. Because, you know, with grandparents yeah. and, you know, with us and stuff, they kind of got the whole enchilada. <laughs> they got an RC car. RC car. Yeah, they kind of yeah. got spoiled. Um, because when we were there, like, grandparents were like, oh, hey, go buy him a toy from us. And we're like, yeah. oh, my goodness, okay. Yeah. And then Landon got like a gift card too from his grandma to pick something out. So yeah, they were just all about like how many toys they could get from Toy Story. Because of the whole Toy Story vibe that was going on with the kids, we ended up finding this little guy. It's a Forky, but it's a, a brush. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and he was just too cute to pass up. He was. So. It was and so every morning though, <laughs> kid you not, every morning when we're getting the kids ready for school and stuff, 
will bust the sucker out, comb the kid's hair I with know. it. And he's awesome because he just like sits on their, you know, a little. In their bathroom. In their bathroom, so I don't have to wonder where the brush goes. Which is also our guest bathroom. Yeah. So if you come to our, ever come to our house, you'll see Forky yeah. hanging out just staring at you when you go to the bathroom. You need to brush your so hair. So it's a little, yeah. a little weird, but. <laughs> now one of my goals was I did want to get like some kind of sweatshirt or spirit jersey, depending on what I found. And I went with the spirit jersey, so I got this one. It's like the um, like rose pink with the gold on it. And on the back, it says Walt Disney World. I love it so much. I kept looking at different ones, and I just kept going back to it. And usually when you kept going back to a certain one, it's just kind of like, OK, I think That's this the is one. the one I want. And I absolutely love it. It's just me. It's just totally me. Yeah, Every time it, I saw it, I'm like. It looks like you when you wear it. It does. Because you're in it. <laughs> <laughs> so here is mine. Now I do have a Disneyland spirit jersey and a Disney World and a Disney, World and a Disney cruise. So Man, just got, the whole, it. got the whole gang. I almost went with a Disney World spirit jersey, but I found something different, which I'll show you. But the one thing that was super bummed that I just couldn't get my mind off of was the the sweatshirt, crew neck the sweatshirt. crew neck that was mm -hmm. sold out the entire time. Like I saw it the first day, and I was super stoked, and I went through the second day, and it was gone. Mm -hmm. and it, it never showed up. We actually asked a cast member and they're like, yeah, that's that's sold out. You only have smalls. I'm like, dang it. So I never got yeah. that. Mm -hmm. But what I did get is this long sleeve. It's mm -hmm. black. Yeah. Which, you know, you know. That's what all your um, wardrobe is. Yep. And I love it because it, you know, has a Disney World icon, mm -hmm. obviously. And then on the sleeve it says Walt Disney World down here. Yeah. Um, I love this. Like I love having like long, light long sleeve shirts like mm -hmm. in the mornings or the evenings or whatever to put yeah. on. Super comfortable. Um, I like it because it's not all cotton. Um, it's not it's not 100% cotton. So it doesn't actually tell me what it is exactly, but on the tag it showed me. But I like that that because it's a little bit stretchy, mm -hmm. which is nice too. Yeah. And then I got something that I normally wouldn't get in the parks, but I got some sweatpants and they're super cute. Um, I love this part about it. It's probably my favorite, but <laughs> it kind of, you can fold that down and you can see the little Walt Disney World Mickey head there and it's got it right there as well. But they're kind of like jogger style. They're so comfortable. I wore them actually on the plane on the way home and I, I'm so glad I got them. They're super comfy. Yeah, just try going back and forth with them. Like, yeah, just get it. I know. And I mean, sweatpants are just like my favorite after I get home from work. That's just. That's what she does. That's what I do. It's her routine. <laughs> she gets home, sweatpants. Immediately. Doesn't even say hi to me. Okay. Boom. <laughs> A little stretch there. <laughs> and uh, lastly, we got one more thing that we, um, I guess it's a souvenir, but mm -hmm. we ended up buying a uh, picture from a ride. Yeah. Which we've never really done that before. We yeah. We didn't purchase like the whole photo pass thing you can get because mm -hmm. we didn't really do very many photos as yeah. far as that. But this one, which I'll show you right now, we did because I was like, this is brilliant. Mm -hmm. I guess it's just this great shot. Yeah. And I'm like, we had to buy this. So we spent like 16 bucks on this photo. <laughs> That's ridiculous. I, <laughs> Hands down, Landon I agree. Landon loves that. But photo Landon though. loves it. I yeah. loved it. And I'm like, we're gonna, we're gonna, we have a digital, obviously. And we're all gonna print it out because I want to try to really find a really cool classic haunted mansion frame to put that sucker yeah. in. Yeah, I thought that'd be a cool like yeah. addition to our studio shelf that yes. we're doing, working on. Working on. Yeah. Everything's changing. <laughs> well, guys, thank you so much for hanging out with us as we showed our Disney World haul. It's pretty yeah. much what we got. I mean, mm -hmm. a lot of the focus was the boys and stuff. And yeah, we don't want to bore you with that. I mean, it, it could be entertaining. Let us know if you guys want them to do a haul of their stuff. Yeah, let us know if you want to see a Disney World <laughs> haul from Landon and Tucker. Oh man, you don't know. You, we have no idea what that would be. I don't know. It's either. probably gonna be complete chaos. But if you want to see it, let us know. We'll see. What and we can do. we'll do it. We'll figure it out. <laughs> well, thanks for watching, guys. This was fun. I feel like we're forgetting something, and I feel like after we close this out, we're like, oh. oh yeah. We bought that too, so we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, um, it was fun to do. I love watching hauls too and just seeing what people got. But um, make sure and watch our next video coming up this Saturday. We do have an exciting travel announcement to share with you guys. We made sure we said travel announcement and not just not exciting just news because when we say exciting something, <laughs> you guys think we're pregnant. Yeah. So we make sure we put that in the title. We have an exciting travel announcement yes. to share with you guys yes. on Saturday. <laughs> Anyways, guys, we love you so much. Thank you so much for all the support um, for this last, you know, couple weeks as we, um, you know, showed these Disney World vlogs. If you mm -hmm. have not seen them yet, uh, we'll link the playlist down below as well for you guys. 
other than that, we'll see you guys in the next one. Yep. Bye. So we're really ex okay. Uh, I have hiccups. Ready? I'm washing my hiccups down with coffee. Is that a thing? Good. Is that good? Probably not.